Now our Neo P sensor has an attached probe. So this is really great for areas where a sensor can't necessarily be submerged or somewhere where you need a little bit of length where you can't put the sensor in itself. So in this video, we're gonna go over how to recalibrate your Neo P. You don't need almost anything. You just need a pitcher full of a 50-50 ice and water mix. Now what we'll go ahead and do is just go ahead, place your probe in the ice water itself. Just let it sit there for a minute. Make sure you have your eye matrix app open. You'll want to go ahead and be looking for your sensor on there. If your sensor is not showing up yet, what you need to do is press this little button on the back of it. You'll see a blue light flash. Go ahead and set that down. Refresh your app. Your sensor should be showing up. Go ahead and click on it so that you can see the updated ratings. Now, after a moment or two, once you get a stable rating, it might not be measuring freezing temperatures. That's fine. We're going to fix that. So go ahead, click on your sensor, get into configure and calibrate. Now, the first reading that we're going to enter, you'll see that there are two boxes. The first box is what your Neo is showing you right now. In the second box, we're going to enter the temperature that we know that the water is at. So that should be zero degrees Celsius or 32 Fahrenheit. Go ahead and save your changes. It'll take your Neo just a moment to give you the new readings with the calibration. So go ahead and refresh your app if you need to. Again, go ahead and press that button. The blue light flashes refresh and check it out. You should see a new updated reading that's more accurate and closer to reading freezing temperatures.